it look like a sustainable like brand of football to you, Lee, across the season? One that can keep them competitive week after week? Oh, time will tell. I mean, you know, I, I guess I've been trained over my footy life. You just sort of think of it. Who knows what's going to happen next week? I don't know what's going to happen next week, and no one knows what's going to happen next week. If you, if you had a lot, enough good good weeks, then you have a chance of actually, you know, putting enough games to play finals and worry about September. But you know, it's uh, I, I note that the um, the people around the footy department are using that word aspirations rather than expectations because mm-hmm. personally, I don't expect or assume anything's going to happen. We know what our aspirations are. That's the simple part. But you ask the question, what's going to happen from now on? That's why we go to the footy to find out. Uh, well, we, we have heard before about your uh, weekly dinners with Chris Fagan. You go for, is it is still steak? Still steak dinners? <laughs> well, we have been winning. So actually, I, uh, I, uh, I, uh, well, we're talking Tuesday afternoon. We will go and have a steak tonight. I had steak last night. I don't want to have steak two nights in a row particularly, but <laughs> we, we can't tempt the footy gods. So, uh, <laughs> You've got to stick uh, with the steak. So we don't, it's not every week, but most Tuesdays we, head, we, both, we live near each other down in Balimba there and head down and, uh, with, the, with the wives and whoever else turns up. Yeah. <laughs>